Welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys to me still one of the best top tie shines on the planet. Nobody talks about it. And this one here can save you a lot of money, a lot of time. Cut down on a lot of usage of tie shine. This is the Meguiar's Ultimate Insane Tie Coating. Now, guys, I'm going to show you how I apply this stuff on a tire. Now, the best way to apply it to me, I shoot it on an applicator, and I talked about it before. It's an old, dusty, crusty sponge I had here. I'm going to show you guys how it does. It does great when you apply it right straight to a sponge. Look at here. A lot of time when you shoot it on the tire, you're wasting a lot of product that you don't need. Look at there. Look at there, boy. Stop playing with him. Look at there. Stop playing with him. Now, see, all that I did was just shot it straight to the applicator and just applied it up here. And I just kind of show you the 50 50 here. Then I'm going to go ahead on and take it all the way around the tire. So. Yeah, all that I did, a lot of people shoot it up there and just wet the whole tire. But see, a lot of times, find out when you do that, you're wasting a lot of your tie shine. So you don't really want to do that. Which I'm going to talk about this is coming up in a live. All right, guys, so I'm going to apply some more to my applicator. Like soap. This old big, crusty applicator that I had. Let's go ahead and apply it. See, when you shoot it on a tire, you're really wasting a whole lot of product. You can just shoot a little bit on this applicator, take it all around that tire, and it's going to look looking good. Check that out. All right. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to apply it on the tire again. We'll put another coat on and show you guys. And I didn't use much of the product either. I just used um, just enough to get by. Watch this, guys. See there? Didn't take a lot of product. Let's go and wipe this in. Check that out. It's nice and glossy too as well right here. Check this out. Nice little gloss. You can take it. We can hit the running boards with it as well down here. Show you it works great for all trim. You can fall back. You can see it. And the way I applied it, man, I just applied it right to the applicator so it didn't take much product to do this. That's another good thing. It didn't take much product to do this. All right, so we're we, we, we going to fall back off it, man. We're going to fall back off it. We'll kind of look at this thing from a distance. I'll we'll show you guys what it look like. This fall bag. Check that out. Oh, yeah, that looks good. And it took very little product to achieve that type of gloss. Check them out. Y'all see it? So you see by how much gloss it gives. Now if you want to apply this to your running boards, we can do that. Alright. So we're going to use a brand new applicator over here. Y'all see how good that look right there, right? I just apply that to the applicator. Alright guys, I'm gonna... matter of fact, on the running board, you just shoot a little bit up here. That's all you need right there. See, don't take a lot. Look at here. Don't take a lot. Get your applicator. It's a brand new applicator here. Kind of rub it in there, you know, like so. And this will get your, run, your running boards looking good without being so greasy, you know what I'm saying? See there, you kind of just got it in there. Kind of massage it down to the material. Same way you did it on the tires here. 
you get it up here, you don't, the trick to it, you don't want it to be greasy, greasy. You know it's gonna attract dirt. Shake your product up, hit it like so. Take your applicator, kind of rub it in there. The objective basically, you want to rub it down into your material, this plastic running board type material, whatever they use to make it. Eh, you just want to kind of get it down in there. Take your applicator, get it in the little creases and stuff. And y'all get ahead. I'm not gonna do this whole running board. You know, but y'all get the idea of what I'm talking about. Check that out, man. See how good that look? And you can tell the rest of it is kind of dulled and kind of look kind of dried out like compared to this. It kind of kind of just put the life back into the running board, I would say, using this. But is this still the best time trim dressing? Could it be? Uh, I think this is around nine or ten bucks at Walmart, which is not bad, considering how good it performs. It lasts a good while, and like I said, I'm not trying to do it perfect. I'm just showing you guys how good this can look on the running board. All right, I'm just showing how good it can look on the running board. Okay. What we got? Boy, it looks good, boy. I tell you, it looks good. And like I told you guys, that's the best way to apply it on your tires. Take it, put it on an applicator, man, and uh, apply it up there. Now, if you spray it up, I seen people that spray the tie down, the tie be wet and all that stuff. Even I used to do it. Until I found out, basically, you're wasting tie shine. You don't need that much product. A can of this stuff will last you forever. Spread into an applicator and then rub it on the tire is the best way to apply this one. This is still basically the best tire shine out there on the market. So, whether well, people talk about it or not, this is one of the best tire shine and trim dressings on the market still today. You can get it on at Walmart. You can get it on Amazon. It's your choice wherever you get it from. But I'll show you guys how it does over there. And it's not, the good thing about it, it's not real greasy. It's just coats the area. It's dry to the touch. It's not greasy at all. It coats that area and it's basically just dry to the touch. So, yeah, I decided to put y'all on. So, a lot of people ain't talking, but they should be talking and should be looking in. This stuff is super duper 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 amazing. Alright. <laughs> Super duper duper amazing. I'm telling you guys, y'all see how good it made my running board look. Compared to the rest of the joint. Look at there. Y'all see it's the, the product speaks for itself. You don't really have to take my word. You see it right before your eyes. So, as well as the tires. Y'all hit that subscribe, man. I don't want to hold y'all too long, but I like to get my point across. All right, and your boy's out.